Hey guys, my name is Dave, and welcome to another video. Another episode, and another episode of Phrases and Sayings. So, I kind of liked how the outcome of the first episode did, so I'm going to go off of a different phrase that I know at least a lot more about than I did the last one. So, today I'm going to be talking about the phrase, Penny for your thoughts. Now, I'm sure many out there, many of you, know what this means already. I guess, in case not, the phrase basically is saying, what's on your mind? Now, sarcastically, it'll get a response of, huh, I'm going to give you my thoughts for a million bucks, or something like that. It's just because they don't want to talk about it, but the penny for your thoughts phrase, it's very intriguing to say the least um i think that when it comes to that kind of thing it's hmm. the wording is very uh complicated it, it, ex explaining it in words outside of what it is can be kind of complicated um the phrase itself, I can't, I don't have any idea how far back it dates. I, again, this is not history talk, so I didn't look up the information on that. This is more kind of a discussion on what, how I feel about the phrase. So, what is it about it that entices me? Well, whenever I hear the phrase, it kind of indicates to me that someone actually cares and wants to listen. Because the only circumstance there you ever hear that. It's like someone's feeling down, or someone looks depressed or upset. Another per person will approach them and go, Penny for your thoughts. And it, most for the most part, they get a response, like a good response, and they'll start talking about it. There are times where this is not the case, but outside of that, it is. And it's very, you know, it's very good to know that there are people out there who actually use that phrase. I've met several people who do more often than not. Now, there are some people out there who just don't at all. Sometimes this is just because they don't know about the phrase, but other re other times the reasoning could be that they just want to bypass it. They only care about their own time at the current moment, which isn't always a bad thing, but not the best thing either. I don't know. Short thoughts on this, but these are my thoughts on the phrase. I don't use the phrase very often, but that's because I usually use other phrasing and other wording. But I digress. I don't know. What are your guys' thoughts on this phrase? Do you have a specific phrase or saying that you'd like to be discussed? Let us know in the comments below. Want to check out the other um, phrases discussed on this channel? Click the link on this side where, well, right now there's just this one and one other, but you'll find a playlist for that. Um... This site will give you a video that you may enjoy a bit more if this isn't quite your cup of tea. Anyways, I'm going to head off. Thanks again for tuning into this video, everyone, and we hope to see all of you in another. Catch you guys later.